got a new show for y'all. Got a damn good show. A lot of times you only hear about what the cops do is when they do something wrong. Yeah. It's like, well, that's the media's point of view. Yeah, that's their, they, they that's have their a, perspective. Yeah, they does. have an agenda. They have a narrative they got to stick to. They ain't about exposing the truth. It's about pushing narratives. It's about pushing narratives. And this video I'm about to show you exemplifies that because... Like the black community has only one way of looking at police officers, especially the white ones. It's like it's they um their outlook, their perspective of the white police officer, their mindset is being corrupted. It's negative. They've been corrupted, man. They've been indoctrinated by the media. They push narratives. They don't push they don't push the truth. So this black family's kid is, I think, choking to death. Cop comes up to help him. Look how they Look at their behavior towards the white police officer who's trying to help that dying black Negro kid. Why do I have to say Negro? I don't know. We got a baby in the diet! What do you mean? What do you mean? Let me see. Can we go, please? Can we go, please? Can we please go? Oh my fucking God, can we please go? Can we please go, She has a sponsor, right? No! 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 Okay, he's getting air. I can feel it. Listen, listen. 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 Why does the cop have to tell you get out of the street so nobody run you over? He about to have a heart attack, bro. <laughs> the baby's breathing now, though, right? Yeah. Look, look at him. The dude having a heart attack. He's breathing. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. He's breathing, okay? That was crazy. You know what's funny? If a pimp or a drug dealer came up, they'd been, they'd, here, take him. Help me, please. <laughs> The cop looks at the guy laying on the ground and says, can you please get out of the street before somebody runs you over? You know what's more disturbing is how the comments, oh, black people's the, comments. On this post? Yeah. The white people's it was comments. like, oh, my God, they saved a the kid's life or that. No, they was thrashing the cops or defending their weird behavior. The, oh, you know, well, let's go to the comments. <clears throat> like this black girl, that really, the hell, that really odd? What the hell does that mean? They kept Two up. things were happening simultaneously. One, they thought the baby was dying quickly. And two, they didn't trust the police. They were horrified and no one knows how they will react under these circumstances. I'm glad the baby is okay. So she's justifying how that, that, they, neg that yeah. negative behavior towards the cops. Normal people say, please help me, police officer. They know first aid. Yeah. <laughs> That's what a normal person. Honestly, y'all don't know first aid. Ah! What the hell is screaming gonna do? I guess in the black community, screaming is first aid. I guess it saves lives in the black community. Man. Only them screaming. Look at this one. These cops did not do a good job. They really should have tried to reassure them better. <laughs> they also seem to have no sense of urgency, nor tell the parents what they were doing as they were doing it. <laughs> How can you reassure somebody? Ah, 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 stay, please don't take my baby. Well, shouldn't, ah. they, shouldn't they focus their attention on the kid getting the kid to breathe? What's more important to you? <laughs> yeah, black people. He even saved the dude that was laying in the street. A cop said, excuse me, sir, can you get up before you get run over? He saved two lives. Saved two lives that day. Saved two Negroes' lives, uh, and y'all can't even give him a compliment. <laughs> Y'all see how black people, man. Let's look at the video again. Black people are difficult, man. Yeah, let's let's look at this. Let's look at it again. 
Did you hear the screaming? Yeah, I'm gonna look at the screen. What? Again. What? Who? Who behaves like this? Well, I'm, I can understand that they're scared. It's their kid. I mean, I'm not screaming. Like if I'm on a plane and it's going down, we're gonna die. I'm not screaming. I'm probably yelling, "Everybody, shut the! <laughs> Let me die in peace." <laughs> that screaming ain't gonna save nothing. Yeah, it's it's um. Let's look at the video again. Man, we got a baby in the diet. What do you mean? What do you mean? They screaming at the car beside him. He's calling the fire department. It would be better if you get out of the car and scream for help. Yeah. Why are you staying in the car? Got the, got the signal on. These people are morons. Don't take her. Man, I'm trying not to laugh at this, but this is... Stop, stop, stop. What was going on with it? No, we don't let him go. He's getting air. He's getting he air. He to the hospital. They said he had COVID. And then he's he just started He's got season. COVID. Okay, he's getting air. I can feel it. Listen, okay. listen. Listen. This is crazy, though. Sir, can you get up so someone doesn't run you over? <laughs> hey, nigga, get up so <laughs> someone won't run you over. Where is this at? Look, he about to have a heart attack. Look at him. Dude is grabbing his chest. Hey, you know what this is, Kevin? What? That dude is surrounded by number black women. There's no man in the house. Yeah. When you're raised by women like that, that's how you're going to behave. That's how you're going to behave. If that's how you're going to behave. If you're raised around women like that, there's no no father figure there. Mm -hmm. That you're going to act like that. You act like a like a black woman. You act like a uh, a black woman, a, a um a hysterical black woman. That's why he's like he's like that. A stereotypical hysterical black woman. Man, what will black where will black people be if it wasn't for white people? Hey, Kim, come on, man. Did I say something wrong? So they're in the car. Wait a minute. No, 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 no. Let's address what you just said. Stop playing. Did I say something wrong? Stop playing. No. I'm where would black playing. people be without white people? They'd be in Africa. You know that, right? Hey, Kelvin, let me say something. No, no, no. I'm going to state the order. Let me finish what I'm about to say. They'd be in Africa. Yeah. Where what would they be doing in Africa? There was Africans here, too, before um, the slaves were brought over. What were they doing? Playing Indian or something. I don't know what they're doing. Oh, it was in teepees. Playing Indian, yeah. Walk around barefoot. No, they had moccasins on, Kevin. You act like they were savages. No, man. No, 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 no. Let's don't try to change history. Hey, Kevin, let me, um, I want to um go over what happened. No, man. Do one for the white man. Now, I don't condone slavery, but they'd be in Africa right now. Karen Tingut. Can them big hey, ass Kevin. buckets of water on the head. You know that, right? <laughs> Walk around with bones around their neck, bones in their nose, and them plates in their lips like this. <laughs> with their lips sagging down to the ground. That's what they be doing. No, but instead, they're here. They're, we do better together with whites and blacks. We, yeah. we, we excel. Yeah. You know? Yeah. We even help white people excel. Yeah. We do better together. I don't understand... Why black people don't see that? Hey, so that's all I wanted to say. So you said they was at the light, right? And they was reaching out, screaming to the car beside, help me, help me, right? You see that? It was like asking them for the help. Cop comes up to help. Cop radios in to help. No, 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 don't take them. I mean, I mean, wouldn't it make more sense if you're screaming for help to get out the car and try to weigh someone down? They in the car. You know what make more sense? Try to get the kid to breathe. Yeah. CPR. First aid. CPR. Yeah. You know, white man stuff. <laughs> white man stuff. See, white man, come, one, white man come up with all these, all these tricks. <laughs> Y'all here. <yeah. laughs> <laughs> somebody help me. Hey, that's a good one, man. White man stuff. White man tricks. Do this. <clears throat> the heartbeat. 
Getting br- White man shit. <laughs> Black people shit. <laughs> 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 Damn savages with y'all. Damn, damn, damn savage. <laughs> hey, man, we got a new giveaway going. We give away a Ford Bronco. It was a show truck. It was in a Las Vegas uh, truck show. It's got $35,000 in upgrades. Not only that. Tell me good stuff, man. That truck, Tell me the best part about the truck. The truck has sentimental value. A January 6er was arrested in that truck by Biden's corrupt FBI. Yeah, this truck's going to go down in history. Just like that Bronco uh, OJ was driving. <laughs> Nathan Hughes, he helps run our contest. Mm-hmm. Him and his team. He's he a dad. He's a patriot. He was test driving the truck. The FBI came in and tried to take the truck from him. I salute you, Nathan Hughes. You a damn patriot. To win this truck, go to officialhawkstwins.com. Anything you buy from the site gets you automatically into the win. And when you win, you get $10,000 in cold, hard white American cash. That white man stuff. Yeah.